you're going to live a life of regret, you're never going to reach your potential, and their success is going to keep making you feel worthless. Unless you, of course... Yo, you alright? You know what this video is about, my brother, because you've seen the title and I'm not here to mess around, so let me get straight in and ask you a few questions. So, why is it, right, that all of your friends seem to be winning at life? And why do they seem like they have no problems and like they have everything perfectly worked out when you are the complete opposite? Why have you not got the same great things that they've got? And why do you feel like you're wasting away and deep down just aren't happy with the way that your life is going overall? You're in and out of shitty jobs, you spend way too much time watching porn and scrolling through social media, and you waste all of your money on stupid shit like branded clothes and f***ing yeah. video games and shit food and you've had enough of it. Of course you have. You want to change your life and be as successful as your friends are, but you don't even know where to begin, right? And every time you've tried to get back on track, you've just fallen straight back into this hellhole, and it feels like you're never gonna sort your life out and that you'll forever be in this position. Well, luckily for you, son, I have a bit of a solution, as I have very much been in the exact same place that I've just described, and I know what it feels like to be a bit of well, a waste man. But I'm willing to bet that you won't act upon my words because it will seem like too much effort or probably cringy, I don't know. But overall, part of you just won't feel like you have the capability to do this. But either way, I'm gonna tell you because I at least want to give you the choice to make your own decision. So first of all, you need to understand that this is just your perception, all right? And your friends aren't actually doing as well as they may make out or as well as it might look like they're doing doing on Instagram because the chances are they are simply validation seeking and showing their success gives them a sense of self-worth and makes them feel like they are the business you know but regardless of their intentions behind it you don't really want to be focusing on them anyway because the minute when you start comparing yourself to others is the minute where you begin to feel like said waste man and there's actually a really good quote that I quite enjoy and I think it's by Theodore Roosevelt, where he says comparison is the thief of joy, and honestly, I live by this quote, I think it's so, so true. But when it really boils down to it, who gives a shit what they've got, or what they say they've got, you know? Just focus on yourself and your values. But what exactly does it mean to just focus on yourself? Well, funnily enough, this is where I used to get stuck, because I didn't know what about myself to focus on. But now I do, which is why I am making videos like these. But in the past, I would get the motivation, and then I didn't know what the next step after that was. And by the time I knew it, the motivation was gone. But yeah, that's in the past, and now I feel like I do know what the next step is. And that next step, my brothers, is self-improvement, which is basically where you live your life trying to learn and improve all areas of your life, both mentally and physically. And I say that because I think when most people think of the term focus on yourself, they automatically just assume it means going to the gym for 15 hours a day and, and working more hours. But actually self-improvement is a lot more than that. It's not just about hustle culture and working as hard as you can and buying a car and getting a mortgage, which is precisely what we are led to believe when we grow up. Because society tends to reward personal sacrifice over doing what's actually important for our mental and physical health, which is just so yeah. stupid, honestly. But anyway, self-improvement is about learning and understanding how to be the best person that you possibly can be. Basically meaning that you learn how to treat yourself with the love and kindness you deserve. And actually that, I suppose, does sound quite cringy when you put it like that. But yeah. I'm willing to guarantee it will not only bring you more success than your friends, but will also give you way more fulfillment from your life. And for the majority of you, it's very unlikely that you'll feel depressed if you are getting 8 hours of sleep per night, and you are meditating, and you are reading, and expanding your knowledge, and exercising, and eating healthily, and journaling, and learning about how to start your own business. Prioritise these things, and the happiness and success that you desire will follow as well. You know, this is a lifestyle that will change your whole perception of life. And I know this because I feel like I am literally on this path 
now and I am so grateful for it. So I guarantee that this will give you all the fulfillment that you are searching for. It's time to level up, my brother, and become the legend that you want to be. I'm gonna go now. Thanks for watching and as always, yeah, um, see ya. Trying to learn and improve all areas of your life, both mentally and physically.